What's up, guys? I'm back with another movie review. Um, I'm talking about a 1972 black exploitation movie. Uh, it's put out by Code Red, uh, but it's not available through the Code Red DVD website. It's only available through DiabolicDVD.com. If you've never shopped there, they're a great store for cult movies, uh, horror movies, just all kinds of like genre films. And these, this is part of a deal between them and Code Red. They've got four exclusive Blu-rays, and this one is the first one. It is called Top of the Heap, and this one is was like written, directed, produced, uh, written, directed, produced, starring, and God knows what else by uh, Christopher St. John, who uh, was in Shaft. Not the main guy in Shaft, obviously, but um, he. This movie is really weird. It, he plays a black cop who's like one of the very few black police officers, and he's basically he gets no respect at work. He gets no respect at home. He keeps getting passed over for promotions at work. His wife just kind of dismisses everything that he says. His daughter is running wild. Um, he fights with everybody. No matter what anybody says to him, he takes it like super personally and flies off the handle. Like one line he keeps saying through the whole thing is like, I'll do any goddamn thing I want, like over and over again. Um, so I like it. I like dysfunctional people. I like to see dysfunctional social situations. And this movie definitely has a lot of it. But it also has a lot of really like surreal things. Like in his mind, he's having these like fantasies where he's a powerful, important person. And uh, they go between like, He's the astronaut who plants the flag on the moon, but it's fake. And then he is in like a ticker tape parade for it. And in another scene, he's in a jungle with a topless woman, and they're smashing watermelon all over each other's faces. Um, it's black exploitation, so obviously it has a lot of like racial issues with it. I don't know if he intended it to be serious. It doesn't play as serious. It plays as absurd pretty much at times. But it is very entertaining. Uh, St. John is really good in this from a wild, off-the-hinges performance standpoint. I love that he argues with everybody. I love that he snaps at everybody. There's a ton of really funny dialogue. Like, even just common little situations he'll call bullshit on and tell him how he's going to do any goddamn thing he wants. He's got a mistress on the side. She even doesn't want anything to do with it, to do with it most of the time. Um, it's... I wouldn't say it's a good movie, but it's extremely entertaining if you like odd movies or black exploitation movies. Um, it's it just has some really weird moments in it that are just really funny and really uh, interesting. It's just a really interesting movie overall. I think um, it does have a girl with a uh, like uh, it's like a gold sequin outfit, which pretty much like gives her a golden camel toe, which is pretty amazing. It has a little bit of nudity, not a lot, a couple topless scenes. Um, as far as violence, it has a really decent car chase scene. Um, then it also has a couple little bitty bits of gore. Nothing major, though. Uh, he does fight with a lot of people, which is a good time. Um, at the end of the day, this is just a really fun black exploitation movie that's really weird, very surreal at times. Uh, definitely worth checking out if you're into the genre or you just like really weird movies. Um, again, this one is called Top of the Heap. And if you're interested in it, make sure that you go to DiabolicDVD.com because it is a Code Red release, but it is only available through their website. And the other three Blu-rays in there are really good. One of them is Cry of a Prostitute, which as of making this video is not available, but I cannot wait to see it. Um, again, it has a crazy scene with Henry Silva raping a woman inside of the carcass of a pig. But that's Cry of a Prostitute. We'll have to wait to talk about that one until uh, I get the Blu-ray. But this is Top of the Heap. It is uh, Code Red Spine number 128. So just because it is through Diabolic DVD, it does still have a spine number. So it is officially part of the Code Red collection. So that's Top of the Heap. Um, if you're interested in black exploitation, check it out. I hope you liked the video, and hopefully I'll have another review up soon.